kill flows, Nintendo Switch. I'm on some shit that's monumental, monumental, artificial intelligence. Jotted down on scribes, the last of a dying breed. They wonder how I survived. Turpentine, turn the tide. Go. What's going on, everyone? This is your boy Ashton, man. And what's the deal? I am here with some awesome news. So, this man talk, what do I want to be talking about? Funimation and Crunchyroll and how Funimation content is moving to Crunchyroll. Now, before I go ahead and get started, um, I just want to let y'all know, like, yeah, your boy has been, you know, away for a few, just kind of handling a few things out there, trying to get things in order, you know, doing big boy stuff. But now, it's time to talk about this Funimation Crunchyroll. Now, if you notice that sometime last year, um, you know, Sony was able to acquire Crunchyroll, you know, they actually bought them out. So now the change that is going right now is that Funimation is going to be moving with their content to Crunchyroll for making Crunchyroll the world's largest anime library um, subscription service that you can be able to get. So <clears throat> what this means is, is that now we don't have to worry about having like different subscriptions or anything. And remember, it's a point in time to where if you would have got VRV, uh, Funimation and Crunchyroll content was all on there. But eventually Funimation kind of like, okay, you know, the deal was over, I'm going my own way. And, you know, VRV ended up acquiring um, High Dev, but they eventually, you know, cut ways with VRV. Maybe it was because of the whole um, Sony acquiring um, Crunchyroll reason why High Dev kind of like went their own way. But that was a few other of the subscriptions that kind of like faded away from VRV, which over time it lost value. But now that Funimation actually got, you know, actually moving their content to Crunchyroll, well, guess what? It's time for that premium service of Crunchyroll to get started. But so this is what it means for your anime. Um, and I'm directly going from the Crunchyroll website now. Um, all on one platform starting today, tons of shows and movies from Funimation and Waka Anime will begin arriving on Crunchyroll. So you will get more doves, more subs, more everything. This is cool and titles available now like My Hero Academia, Tokyo Go Yu Yu Hakusho, along, um, alongside favorites like Cowboy Bebop, um, Michelle Go Tensei, um, Re Reincarnation, all under one subscription. Take out the list of the new arrivals on front row, which will be more to come. So that means that right now they probably have like quite a few titles that is arriving on Crunchyroll, but not all of Funimation, you know, content is on there just yet. More to come. So also this means that new series in the upcoming spring uh, season, the biggest on the record, stay tuned. Uh, Beyond will only stream on Crunchyroll. Moving forward, Funimation will only add new episodes of continuous series, which means Funimation users will want to move a Crunchyroll account as soon as possible. So eventually, it sounds like Funimation is probably going to be fading away pretty soon. They probably going to have it under one brand, which is going to be Crunchyroll, and that's a huge thing. Um, so eventually, you will probably want to move to Crunchyroll Premium. So this is why now, as a welcome to the new Crunchyroll family, Funimation will come in and BRB subscribe subscribers will get a special deal for 60 days um, of Crunchyroll Premium free. Mm. Over the next few days, qualified uh, Funimation Workman and VRB uh, subscribers will receive the email with the unique link to redeem. Now, me personally, I'm probably going to have two because I do have VRB and I have Funimation because, of course, some contests and some contests is on each other. So that's actually a thing in itself. So that's actually pretty damn big. What this amount to be a big, we are now bound to the question of the, of the frequency answer. So all that good job on me. Pretty sure people still have questions. But as Crunchyroll Funimation into the new, uh, into this new era together, we cannot be more excited to bring together a very rare community of anime fans, creators, and artists. Thank you for taking me anime to the next level with us so yeah Whew. that's 
that's big it makes it all the better like not only are you able to save because of this but now you get the best of both worlds all under one umbrella you don't have to worry about like myself of having you know control and fundamentation be a surfer or making sure that your cues is right to make sure which one's watching on because sometimes they will have it to where they're like my hero will both premiere on Crunchyroll and Funimation you got to choose which platform maybe you know it shows a little bit better on Funimation or maybe you know the English subs is probably a little bit better on Crunchyroll you always have to make that decision on which poison that you want to pick but now since it's under one I mean it's a little bit more better especially if they're going to be moving everything to the Crunchyroll umbrella so in a minute Funimation is kind of want to die out or whatever maybe just just die out completely but we will see but for the most part this is like very good news in my opinion so and again thank you guys for the um for the man talk i will be coming back with some streams this weekend so be tuned into that but other than that you guys have a wonderful one peace